Hey guys, it's me SS Tell Toby. Today I'm actually going to be doing a kind of a reaction video, but I've already filmed the clip that I'm going to be doing, so instead of me having to go back and do my voiceover and stuff, I'm just going to edit the clip so that you hear my voice in between each scene that I want to talk about this idiot. His name is Rags. Reynolds and he is obviously missing a few brain cells. He thinks Australia does not exist So I'm gonna do a, a kind of reaction to it and I Don't know we'll see what happens it, Like and subscribe there will be a link to my Instagram down in the description and I hope you enjoy the video It's not real it is not fucking real. Australia does not exist. Is that what the doctor said when they were trying to find your brain? It does not exist. It is not real. It isn't real. Can't you delusional fucks get that through your thick skulls? It isn't real. It doesn't exist. Get over it. It's not a real place. This guy sounds like he's on something. Seriously. Needs to stop. But whatever he's taking, he should pass me some. I, I need that. You janky ass cunt weaves are really beginning to get on my nerves. Well, accent is that nerves. Nerves. Just trying to get on my nerves. What the hell? You really are. You think that this nonsensical place actually exists? There's no proof that it exists. There's no sense in thinking that it could ever possibly be a real place. If Australia is not a real place, then where the hell am I making this reaction in? I mean, am I making it in New Zealand? I mean, I'm pretty sure that there's Australia outside my window. I can't see that actually, that's too bright. But yeah. Yet you all still, Australia is real! No it's not, it's not real. It's a fantasy. It's no more real than Narnia. Or Middle Earth. Or that weird place where the Teletubbies live. I don't actually know where the Teletubbies even live. So, yeah. That's probably because I never really watched that show, never got into it. But, I can kind of agree with him on this part. I actually don't know where the Teletubbies live at all. If someone knows, let me know in the description, or let me know in the comments. Australia! It isn't a real place. You claim it was discovered by Captain Cook. You know what that sounds like to me? It sounds as legit as Captain Hook, as Captain Birdseye, and Colonel Sanders. Why is he comparing a serial to an actual person? Like, what the hell? Why are you comparing food to a person that actually exists? Uh, that actually did exist. Sorry, he doesn't. I don't think he's alive anymore. He's he'll be a bit dead. That's what it sounds like to me. That's what it sounds like to anyone who has a slight, a slight amount of rationality in their brains. It's nonsense to think that Australia could be a real place. Have you ever heard of anywhere else with so many deadly animals and... Yeah, I have heard of other places with deadly animals. It's called America. 
I mean, humans are classed as animals. America is having riots right now, so that makes them deadly. And plus, they get a lot of they get a lot of practice using guns at school, so I'm pretty sure they're good with shooting. Strange looking, different things that are nowhere else in the world. They have they have spiders bigger than birds. Yeah, and we have brains bigger than peanuts. How how does that happen? It doesn't. That's that's what happens through evolution. Animals get into different countries sometimes, somehow, some fly, like birds. They might get pushed off of where they're migrating to by a, a strong wind or something, and they'll end up on an island, say like the Galapagos Islands, and they have to evolve to hunt there and all that stuff. That's the answer. It doesn't happen. It only seems to happen in Australia, because Australia isn't real. If something doesn't exist, then you can make anything up about it. Oh, what's next? We're going to have penguins that can fly? Fat people who are fat just because of their genetics? The Cookie Monster? Uh, I mean, technically the Cookie Monster is real. All you have to do is dress up like a monster and start eating cookies. Boom, you have the Cookie Monster. This is like Santa Claus, dude. Some people believe Santa Claus doesn't exist. He does. All you have to do is get someone a guard someone's door, knock on it, leave a gift down with a note saying from Santa, and hide in the nearest bush. And then when the person answers the door, looks at the gift, they'll see the note from Santa, and... Boom, you're Santa. Pansexual people? Okay, I know pansexual people do exist. I don't really know what the word pansexual means. I'm not really too familiar with that, but I do know that they do exist and that they are real people. Cyberbullying? Okay, cyberbullying does exist. You should never be doing cyberbullying. And if you have, if you do get cyberbullied, you should be reporting that. I've had it happen. It is not fun at all. I've had friends that have haven't ha yeah, have had cyberbullying before. It is not fun. And trust me, honestly, it's. No, you never get over it, trust me. You just never get over it. What's next? What are you going to pretend is real next? None of these things are real! But if Australia's real, then anything could be real! What? <laughs> oh my... If Australia is real, then what stops these other insane notions from being real as well?